100 degrees today. We, we have our buddy degrees. Debbie Matinopoulos here. With us. You're going to be cooking I'm for cooking, us. I'm cooking, and we're going to be eating. Yes. And I'm going to cook you some recipes from my new cookbook. It's all Greek to me. That's yes. it. Yes. <laughs> Actually, we're just going to talk about that. All right. There, there it is. is. Oh, there it is. Before we get into anything, we want to congratulate you. Oh. Marriage and a baby on the way. That's been up four months. <laughs> There's nothing there. Oh, what is going amazing. on? I swear it's in there. I just saw it. Oh I just had gosh. an ultrasound. I, you know, the, you, you look awesome. Thank you so <laughs> much for being here. Now, you eloped, right? I did. Oh my I did. Gosh. Well, the photographer of the book is my husband. And we were in Greece. We're shooting the book. We had talked about it. We wanted to do it anyway. So I said, you know what? There's this little church, like, slash monastery thing on the way to my parents' house in this little beach town. I thought, we kept driving past it. So let's just ask. And so we did, and we worked out. There he is! Oh, oh, oh my God, God. that is so beautiful! <laughs> oh That's an awful picture of me, but he looks oh, cute. Oh, get out no. of there! You're glowing! <laughs> that is so awesome. So you guys just decided to do it? Yeah. We Wait, said, is that her husband? There's there her husband. No. <laughs> <laughs> That's Peter, my book partner. Yeah, Peter. That was great. No. Okay. Oh so, God. hi, Peter. <laughs> Baby daddy. Yes. I know oh, that. yes, we know who the baby daddy is. Right. But now, what made you decide to do a cookbook? Well, because I always cook for all my friends, and everyone always wondered why. Are, did you go to culinary school? And I said, No, I'm Greek. I mean, if you're a Greek woman and you grew up in a Greek household, you know how to cook. Right. And if you don't, there's an issue. <laughs> and, and and everyone would always, you know, they'd they'd request things from me. Mm -hmm. And my mom is such a great cook, and I learned to cook through all my family's recipes. So I thought, you know, I want to put all my family's recipes together in a, a cookbook and share it with the world because Greek food is so much more than just baklava. Oh, there's my dad and my mommy. Oh, Aww. look at that. Aww. And my dad just passed away and I dedicated the book to him. Oh, And gosh. I'm giving a, a part proceeds, of the proceeds of the book are going to the ALS Association Oh, for him. gosh. Aww. Well, our condolences oh, for that. But, oh, yeah. what a beautiful picture but of you so, guys. So, I mean, I felt like it was important to share the world that it's more than baklava and suvlaki and gyro and we're all so used to that but there are really there are huge health benefits to eating the mediterranean way of course we hear the studies all the yes. time yes i mean the mediterranean diet is really it's heart healthy it's good for your cholesterol it's good for a lot of different things and i had one of the leading cardiologists in the country dr michael osner write my foreword because he believes so wholeheartedly literally in in the mediterranean diet he took his patients off of medicine put them on a mediterranean diet and they improved dramatically without wow. medicine. So there's something to it. You know, the main ingredients in most Greek food is oregano, olive oil, and lemon. You know, okay. they're all antibacterial, antiviral, immune and, boosting. Yeah, okay. You know, olive oil lowers cholesterol. It, well, it, now it, you're Greek because you're talking, but now we need to get yeah, you. Okay. 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 Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. What are you going to make? Okay. I'm going to make you exquisite, savory meat pie, which is called. Um, Kreatopita. Kreatopita. And that's this right here. It's okay. leek and lean ground beef. Okay. Let's do this. Let me and put this on. onions and some spices. Okay, so, so you got the olive oil. Uh, yeah, I've got the olive oil. Extra virgin or? EVO, baby. Okay. Okay. So Always sure. extra virgin around here. <laughs> what you do is you put the olive oil in, you separate the, the leeks, the white from the green part okay. because they, they cook differently and some water, more water comes out of the um, white than they do the green. Okay. So then, and you have to cook the whites for less time than you do the green. You put that in okay. oh, me, with onion and you okay. saute that for about, I don't know, five to six minutes. Okay. So while so that's going, you then throw in the green and get that going. Oh, I love that. Yeah. Yeah. Now, now we're now. cooking. Right? Isn't that nice? Okay. Oh, God, so and nice. in here, what do we and have? here, you also put water because they're a little harder. Okay. You get that going as well. You also put in, oops, what the salt and pepper and oregano. And we're throwing that on, oh, the, on the white side, right? Yeah, it's okay. all going to go in together anyway, oh, okay, so it perfect. doesn't matter. I okay. mean, truthfully, you want to it's all going in one place. You want okay. to cook them separate to begin with, just so this kind of burns off and gets a little softer. These are harder, mm -hmm. the green parts. So you yeah, but you can already see them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And Talking I don't know if, you know, you, do you eat leeks very often? Yes, absolutely. Leek is like a mild... It's a mild onion. It's mm -hmm. what onions wish they were. If yeah. God went to heaven, they'd be a leek. That's it. Okay. Right. So then, and you have a little bit of mint. You have parsley. You throw this all in together. Which are all really fabulous ingredients. If you really look at this good here right for now, you. the base, you're like, you're you're making a pan right now. Exactly. Uh huh. Now, now this is, well, first of all, you got to. cook it separately? Do you, you cook it separately and then first? you put everything together? You know, I guess okay. I could Can I help you? Yeah. Yes, please. please. Okay. Please what would you me. like? You're oh, half great. Come over here. Come over here. Hi, babe. Timing. What we're going to do now is, I mean, this actually needs to go 
go for about six minutes, but so this is live TV. We're not having any time. Cooking. Yeah. It's TV cooking, baby. We'll there put it all go. together. Okay. okay, now when you're gonna, you're gonna throw in the meat now, right? I'm gonna throw the meat in. Okay. And now where's our meat that's done? But, uh, we have the magic of television. We have a where's meat that's done. Meat? It's right down here. Because this now, is what happens. It's when we oven. talk about this, it's there right you there. go. And there's the oven. Oh, I do want to ask you quickly. You're gonna be returning to the view, which is such. I just went back yesterday. Yeah, but you're gonna be back on the 16th, isn't that right? To send Barbara off. I am. I'm so sad to see Barbara go. Yeah. I mean, I think everybody's really sad to see Barbara. Oh, look, there's me and Elizabeth. Oh, check that <laughs> out. Elizabeth, what's happening? Awesome. <laughs> yeah, she's going to be back there with me. And Lisa and Joy and Star and Meredith and Rosie and, oh, my gosh, how many more are there? I know. I hope they're coming. Yeah, there's everybody that's going to be there. But, um, you know, while this cooks, why don't we talk about some of the other dishes you brought? Yes. Right? We're, We're never going to get through one. this. There's a lot of food. No, okay. You know what? Why don't we eat You know something? what? Put me to I'm work. Gonna, I'll I'll this what is this over here that Carolina has? This is eggplant. That is eggplant dip. Mm, it's okay. mezzanos a lata. Oh, my God. And by the way, this is way better. Try the mm. creta Okay. The healing powers of Greek food are very important. It's not I just satiating, but it's now, delicious. Now, do you put olive oil in your hair, on your face? Do I you put it? olive oil everywhere. I know, yeah. my yaya. Oh, all over. Oh, my yaya. So yeah, you. You're so cute. Oh, you know, my first boyfriend was Dino Toliopoulos. Oh. Like, I'm telling you. I was introduced to Greek cooking a long, long time ago. I'm cutting so I should cut. Paracalo. I love that. Wow, I this is delicious. Taste it too. Is it good? Yeah, sure. Well, we don't have the Can floor. I eat it? Oh, my God. Let's yeah. <laughs> this is so wrong. It's and so then what delicious. And what are these, are these lentils over oh, here yes. to my left? Oh, my gosh. What that are these really lentils, good, Debbie? Say so myself. And you brought cake. Those and you good. did. And you, mm -hmm. and you mean it. It is delicious. That's what I need. It's semolina. Um, okay. Sweet semolina sort of cake. It's really spongy and it has a simple syrup which is oh delicious. Semolina is really healthy for you and that's just mm. beautiful cold lentil salad. We're going to try them. all of them. Thank you Debbie Matinopoulos. We want to allow everybody to pick up. The delicious recipes are in. It's all great to me. It's on sale now and you Thank can catch you. Debbie at her book signing this Friday 7 p.m. Oh, yeah. at Barnes & Noble 86 and Lexington. Yes. We got it when you're off.